Today is our first late night shift at Channel 9. Now, of course, there's a big time difference between Paris and Sydney, and I make sure I pack all of my notes, and I write about seven or eight pages for every event, so I've got all the information I need to go all night. Now, we rocked up, and today I have a quick live cross to Paris, so I had to go in, get a little bit of makeup done, but really, you, you don't need much. Did a full uniform change, so I had to take the suit straight off and put on a Channel 9 polo shirt, and live cross to Paris. Now we're talking about the event tonight. We have both Ellie and Mel who just need to make it through to the semi-finals before I ran upstairs because we we're cutting it close with timing to jump straight in to the preliminary commentary with Mark Taylor. Now it's our first preliminary event and it went for about two and a half hours, so a bit longer than we're used to. But we went down and had some dinner. Channel 9 always provide a really good feed. I printed off and organized my notes for the semi-finals as the order changed after the prelims. It's about 11 p.m., so starting to get a little bit tired. But once you start commentating, the excitement drums up and you feel ready to go. The semi-finals were great. Both our Australians made it through to the final, which is really exciting. And after that, we got to dig into the forbidden pies and sausage rolls. Now, you're only allowed to eat these if you stay at Channel 9 past 12 o'clock. And last week, the latest nights we were doing was around 8.30, 9 p.m., so I've been looking forward to this for over a week, and boy, was it worth the wait. But we have a whole week of late nights here.